Hi everyone, Mehmet is here. Today I will review another graphics tablet. This is a brand new 2021 model XP Pen Deco Mini 7W graphics tablet. It is wireless and a little bit bigger than small size tablets. So it's interesting. Let's get started. <music> XP Pen released Deco Mini 7 last summer and this is Mini 7W. It's the wireless version of that model and it looks very similar to the bigger brother XP Pen Deco 01 version 2, right? The same design, but this is wireless. Deco 01 version 2 is about 70 US dollars, this is about 60 US dollars and Mini 7 non-wireless version is about 50 US dollars on Amazon. But you know the prices always change, uh, for the current prices you can check the links in the description below. This video is not sponsored by the way, I received the product free for an exchange of my honest review. Okay, let's do a quick unboxing first and then I will review guys XP Pen Deco Mini 7 W graphics tablet. The tablet comes in this box and here's the Mini 7 wireless graphics tablet. I like the design, it's good and it has a matte surface, my favorite. There are 8 custom buttons on the tablet. Um, there is a USB-C port for charging and the on-off button here. This is the back side with 4 rubber feet. Here's the pen, it's a new generation XP Pen stylus. Of course it's a battery free stylus, it looks comfortable. There is a rubber grip here and as always there are two side buttons on the pen. This is the USB-C cable, it's a really good quality cable guys, I like it. Here is the USB receiver for the wireless connection. We have a lot of extra nips and a nip remover here. These are Android mode adapters, one micro USB and one USB-C and manuals. The tablet has a plug and play option, but I am going to download the driver and show you how it looks like. You can find the website link in the description below. Click the link, go to xppen.com, choose the category, find the product and download the software. By the way, Deco Mini 7W is compatible with Windows, Mac, Linux and also Chromebooks. Here's the software. It has settings about working area, monitors, express keys and pen side buttons. Ok, let's check the tablet now. The tablet is wireless. I am going to connect this USB receiver and start checking. I will use PDF annotator for that. Let's start writing. Ok, writing is good. The tablet surface is smooth and the pen is really comfortable. I like it. You can see my writing guys. They look natural and uh, they are clean, right? Yes, everything is good. Um, you can also teach online with your Android device. I am using USB-C adapter, comes with the tablet. Uh, by the way, I couldn't use it with uh, the USB receiver in Android mode. Um, that's why I am connecting the cable now. Okay, you need to use the tablet vertically in Android mode and you can write it just like that. This is a Huawei Android device and you see the pointer is visible on the screen. But if you are using a Samsung device, and experience cursor problems guys, you can click the eye icon on the right top corner and check the video to fix the cursor problem. Ok, it's time to talk about pros and cons. I will start with pros. The tablet surface is great, it is matte and matte surfaces are best for online teachers. The tablet is slim, um, it's not the slimmest one but it is slim, it looks modern and the best part is guys the tablet is wireless so you don't need to worry about the cables around you, you can just charge your tablet after your lessons. Um, it has a USB Type-C port and yep the cable is really good guys and it's an L-shaped USB-C cable. It is my favorite. It's really convenient to use L-shaped um, chargers. Finally, let's talk about the pen. It's great to see good quality pens with small size graphics tablets guys. This is a new generation XP pen stylus. It also has a rubber grip. So this is super comfortable and it's heavy enough. So I love the pen. It is really, really good. And cons. One thing. There is no pen holder in the package and usually small size graphics tablets do not come with pen holders. They can make their own pen holder. Um, yes, it's actually a good idea. Oh, you remember the picture, right? Yes. I showed you. Yes. I have a friend, guys, uh, Rui Fernandez from Portugal. He's one of my viewers. So he sent me his setup and I'm going to show you guys. You can also create a pen holder, um, something like that, if you need. 
Okay, that's it for today. If you have any questions, don't forget to leave a comment below and let me know. I will answer your questions as early as possible. See you next time. Keep watching Mathematics. Goodbye.